Hello, and welcome to a, another edition of uh, Chaos Craft kind of screencast. Um, uh, this is my kind of technical breakdown. Hopefully, I'm using the right mic this time. But uh, it basically breaks down into three pieces. The dub 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 is mainly an interface. You guys have seen me to monitor stuff and look at things. The oops. The server is what kind of controls all their brains behind the scenes. It's uh, it's it generates the brains and it says when the when the new bots load up, they ask it immediately like, "Hey, who am I? Who do you want me to pretend to be this time?" And then when they die. Or, you know, they, they check in with the server and say, hey, this is, you know, I, I haven't moved in 30 seconds. It's like, yep, you know, you're dead. Um, and then there's the bot, which is chaos craft here, but it's, it's the bot. It's the main shebang. And I just actually added some commands that I should add to the readme. But the first command you're going to want to run, if you pull this down, uh, you know, you can clone or download it. Somebody asked about running it, um, it was Mr. Bone or something like that. Thank you for the question. I do appreciate it. Um, NPM build. So that's what you want to run first. And that's going to create a dist folder because it's um, TypeScript. And you just want to run that. You'll have, you'll have to install NPM first. Um, you want to, you know, I could probably put a link to installing Node.js um, if you want that all local. Um, and NPM is Node Packet Manager. And then from there, you want to run npm start, and that will kick it off. And you can see here the brain firing up, and it loaded up. It uh, gave it a Dave Chappelle. That's Dave Chappelle uh, eight DMAV. Uh, I was just on this thing. Come on. I put a little peep. I could pause this thing so you guys didn't have to watch me search frantically for a uh, for the IP address. What happened here is that my um, this will hopefully change by the time you guys watch this thing. Otherwise, some of you guys are going to get into my server and knock it over, but it'll just boot up in another IP address. It's running on a Docker process, and when it runs out of memory, it kind of just restarts and loses the level, which I don't really care about because these guys destroy the level and those damn explodey things roll up and blow these guys up. So somewhere on here, what blew this blew up? What happened here? Huh. Interesting. That's a new era. But either way, you can see that he joins. You can see that uh, we got what H A you know, David D Chappelle, and we can we shorten the username because otherwise it doesn't like it. It freaks out if the username is too long. But it ends with E L capital A V. We go back to the game. E L capital A V is at the top there, and he's running amok somewhere in here. So let's see if we can see him. Oop, there goes one of them. Now that's a sibling. He's got to be somewhere around here. Running amok. Um, so, let's get back to it. So that's how you start a bot. And if I wanted to start another one, I've got it, I've got a WebStorm set up, so I can just you know click debug and it'll do another one. But if I wanted to start another one, I could just do... Um, you guys don't have to do that. I have this in the subfolder. npm start. And it'll just boot up a sibling for it. So you can see here we've got uh, Dave Chappelle. Oh, Yell AV. This guy must have switched out. Yeah, he switched to AB2F. Just must have lost connection or something. But oh, AB2F, is that it? Oh, that's his ID. I'm an idiot. Um, it's LAW, capital AW. So you can see we've got one. So those two are the guys running up. See, we've got. See, this is cool. Generation 8. And I, he could be randomly running away or he could be escaping. Um, so that's how that works. Um, you guys can point it at my server, which is fine. Um, so you guys don't need to host your own server. If you guys run it in this mode, you won't need to run a server locally. Uh, he's going to get eaten. Um, if you guys run it in this mode, yeah, it'll, it'll ping off my production server, production quote-unquote server. Um, so you guys don't have to host it, but if you did, you could pull down the server and it'd be fairly similar. Um, 
what I got to do is I need, I realize I checked in some configs to my database. The th tricky thing is here, you need to have Redis running and you'll need to have Mongo running. You just have to need your own because I'm not giving you direct access to my Redis and my MongoDB. But again, I'm not encouraging you to run the socket server being as I already got one up there. Um, and then the dub, 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 you can pull down and this thing is all types of messy right now because it's the least, you know, it's an Angular 2 app. So if you have any experience with Angular 2 and you want to help me clean it up, by all means. But my fatal flaw, because I'm kind of lazy, is that dub, dub, dub only points at local right now. So I don't, you have to go through and uncomment all that if you want to point it at the production servers and stuff. Eventually, I will get a dub, dub, dub interface up and running. And maybe I'll figure out a way to give you guys, if I put, I need to put actual authentication on the servers, but you guys would be able to be like, sign up for an account or somehow basically say these are my AIs and my system, my server would just like remember that they're yours, that you've evolved. So that way you're not killing my AIs and you guys can point them any server you want to and I'm not killing your AIs. And uh, actually, shit, that might just be a business model. Sorry, if there's kids listening. Sorry about that. I've usually tried to swear. Sorry. Um, shoot, I said, yeah, with an accent. Um, so, yeah, so that's kind of how you set this thing up. It's not rocket science to get the bots going. Like I said, you can run two at once pretty easy. Another thing you might want to check out is forever. That's how I was running it on my desktop here before I bricked it. Today, hopefully I can unbrick that thing. But uh, yeah, it's, um, you see the brain picking in the background here. They're trying to dig stuff and moving around. I did, yeah, I'll do this in a separate video, but I actually was really excited for my leaderboard. That's the next video I'm going to do is the leaderboard. So I'm going to save that for later. Again, you go to GitHub. I'm going to put this in the show notes. You check out uh, Chaos Craft, not Consult Like a Badass, which is a book I'm thinking about writing if you're interested in consulting and making a living off that. Check it out. But you go there. It'll be this link slash Chaos Craft or maybe dash bot by the time I get to this. And I'll have instructions in here, but basically you run, oh, you got to run NPM install as well, but I'll have that in there as instructions. If you know basic node, it should be a walk in the park. And if not, it's actually still pretty simple. Uh, you could have this up pretty quickly. So with that said, on that uh, with Chaos Craft, please feel free to uh, comment and link or yeah, comment or like or whatever. Like, let me know what you like to see, what you don't like to see. Um, ask questions about this setup. Um, I'll have more in the readme pretty soon. Uh, thank you very much and uh, have a wonderful day.